Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Kirby's Epic Yarn. In the last episode, I failed miserably at this level. So, I was nice enough to go off screen and fix it. Because I'm a nice LPer like that. All the other LPers are just nice to me, apparently. Anyways, um, got like Princess Luna going over there. Jesus. Princess. Actually, it's. It's, uh. Died. Uh, I failed the bronies horribly. I don't care. Nope. Nope. Just Chalk Testa. I, I got a scary Chalk Testa voice. Oh shit! We only just started. Didn't lose that much. Play drums like pro. Ah, the musical notes section. The song. Come here, Mr. Man. This level's awesome. I love this level. I love the design. I love the, the theme of the music. And the, this is awesome. This is awesome level. This is what more game levels need to be like. Like in Kirby and stuff. There's only one other game that had a level like this. And that's freaking Elmo's World. And I hate that game. Obviously. And then it comes out that I'm secretly playing that game behind everyone's backs, like on a daily basis. Every day I play Elmo's World. I love Elmo's World. Elmo's World is a fun game. Oh, I just freaking just below up there. Oh, I know where it's leading me. Actually, I don't know where it's leading me, but still. Beautiful though, really. I can never. Oh goodness! Oh, this part. Yes. This is the weird. This is when things get weird. Does actually make a weird sound? This is also the really hard part right here. Luckily, it's just freaking. It's only. The, uh. Between the lines, the spaces. I'm standing in your head. I'm right in your head like a man. What if he ever stabs up at you? Oh, it's been down here. Oh, I don't think I ever did. The harp either. Do, do, do. Oh, this is an easy level, too. Hard time to get away from the hard levels. And yeah, just enjoy ourselves. You know? Because that's the kind of levels I want to do. This also isn't very hard when you know what you're doing. It's been good again. It's for fun. The face he makes when he hits those. That's adorable. That was everything. Uh, and this is... What the fun... F the fun if I just counted to five. Actually, I didn't count to five, but I said what the, uh, then I said five. I wonder if anyone would like... Anyone would know that. Where's that musical note going? Where's that silly little note going? Where is it going? Oh, 
Oh, there's beads over there. Let's go to those. We all love harmonicas. It's not a harmonica, what am I saying? Love you, game. Get up there, Kirby, go! Ooh, music melody town, okay. Good thing I came back for those beads. I really didn't know that was there. Vikings! What's this for? Note that the drums get a little like blackened when you get on them. I don't know why. Sad now. What am I gonna do? This I feel so sad. Emo, I'm gonna jump over here. Oh shit! That didn't work. That didn't work. No! My gold rating. Oh, well, I'm actually gonna get gold rating anyways. Was worth it. Also, I never stated this, um, uh, that, note that the fact that Prince Fluff actually has, like, the Kirby sprites programmed into him as well, with his colors and stuff. Um, I just never noted this, that he's actually the, uh, if you play co-op in this game, he's player two. So, I don't know, really, it really matters to the players. Like, if someone really wants to be Prince Fluff, I guess you could, like, I'm sure there's, like, a cheat code to play as him or something, but... Because I know there's a cheat code to play as Luigi, and... New Super Mario Bros. and he's the second player. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, this looks scary. I'm gonna have nightmares tonight, kids! Are we really this far already? <laughs> squashy! -de, squashy! -de. I wanna make my fit to cheat! Uh, that was not racist at all. Good job. That's the problem with this level, by the way, kids. I don't know why I think kids are this fucking. You'll end up going to level to level trying to do this. <laughs> get to the right level you want to get to. I think there's actually a way you could... Is there a way you could do this? No, there's not. I thought there's a way to skip that. Okay. There he goes. It's squashy. I am squashy. Oh, he actually is Italian. But they never note that. But you can tell he's Italian. He even plays the music, sounds like he's Italian. I love how he like, dances like he's all excited. Hello, Squashy! Hello, welcome to my battle! Hello, what are you doing? What are you doing, Squashy? I'm a car, I do live like, like, like a, like a Florida. Is a Florida even a word? What's in the Squashy? It's hot. Okay, I'm gonna use an Italian accent. I say it's not an Italian accent, it's like a. Uh, Dracula accents. Oh shit, I was supposed to pay attention? Well, that did real good. Oh, it's a little Star one. It's actually the Crystal Star Sprite from Mario, Paper Mario, Thousand Year Door. Also, you will get addicted to the kid the beads, and you'll get to the sad places. Toro, Toro, what the hell is he doing? Did that do anything? 
I guess you can throw it back at him. I'm not sure how, but you can. Sure you can. Let's pay attention this time. Well, let's see in this one. Well, how do you know which one you're in? This boss fights hard. I don't know anything. Oh, but I should do this really good. Oh, I gotta shake my remote. I didn't know that. Here's got the trick up his sleeve. Um, I, I'm getting really out of commentary for this fight. This isn't really a commentary type fight. It's just like a pay the frick attention kind of fight. Oh, it actually works. Uh oh. Well, at least it's the one where you get a lot of money, so let's screw it. Let's screw it. <laughs> I don't know why I said that. Run! Get out of there! Oh, nothing left. Oh my god, what happened? I think it's like bonus or something, I don't know. Like the whole thing's sparkling up there. I think I did a really good job. How do I know which one you're in? Little one? Okay then, I didn't even know what I was doing. <laughs> and that's it. And in the next episode... We will do the bonus we levels. It. We got the magic yarn. The magic yarn shimmered and spiraled and swirled high into the sky. The yarn weaved its way into the fabric of the kingdom and stitched two pieces of patch land together. Kirby and Fluff came upon a cake the size of a mountain. It was breathtaking. <laughs> Kirby tried to contain himself, but failed. He dove right in and started gobbling up the cake. I declare a cake-eating duel. And with that, Prince Fluff jumped into the cake as well. The this two is the worst story and ever. And ate, but they didn't balance their eating very well. Whoa! And before they could get down, the cake collapsed with them inside it. Oh, I can't eat another bite. Prince Fluff moaned as he rubbed his cake-filled belly. But then, is there a story? Kirby this is appeared a story with a huge cherry in his mouth. Whoop! Kirby won the contest, and a looming tummy ache as well. <laughs> Those two are the good. I'm just kidding. And that's, uh... 
Oh shit, do you really have to bother me about that? It's like hitting back in the back. So I has a much of a call it a patch. I will place that. And now there's ice cream cone things. And Coco Station. That's actually a really cool level. I don't like it because of the fact it's one of the train levels. But it's a lovable level. And a lot of people do like this level. It's usually a fan. That's not actually a fan favorite. It's actually a fan hated. But still, a lot of people do like this level for some reason. I don't fucking know. I, I hate the, the train power. And then the next episode, we will do that. And then the episode after that, we'll go here. The next world. And then I don't know. Uh. I think we're actually almost done. I have a map button. Yeah, there's only two worlds left. Well, three worlds left, but one of them's not on this map. Actually, I think you can... Huh. Oh, you can teleport! No one tells me these things! That's why there's a map button! Well, this is a quick way to turn on progress. Okay, so in the next episode, we'll freaking get closer to 100%. And I swear, when we get 100%, um... Uh, I don't know. I'm also planning on doing a bonus episode at the end of some kind of way. Like, full of shit, I don't know. This game doesn't really have any, like, mini-games like all the other Kirby games do. So I couldn't do a bonus episode if I wanted to. So, uh, that sucks. So in the comments section below, tell me, uh, we're getting close to the end of this game. So I need you guys in the comments section below, just give me some suggestions. And you can do this in all the episodes, just give me some suggestions for episode for LPs to do. And, uh, I might just do one of them LPs. So, eh, just freaking leave a comment and if I like the comments I'll tell I'll probably comment I'll probably message you so uh and I'll also give a shout out so thanks for watching